Taurus, thank you all so much for joining me here. This is going to be your daily reading, Taurus, for your general and love energies for the day. And I will be also picking out messages your person has for you, Taurus. In case if you guys in, are in a separation state or twin flame separation, soulmate separation, a runner chaser stage, this card and this reading will really help you move forward in your spiritual journey. So anyways, guys, let me pick out cards for your general energies first. And then I will be moving on to your love situation. My beautiful Taurus. Really sorry guys, some of these cards are turned upside down, so I will just be, I feel like for a few of you, you are really wanting, you have a dream relationship, you, you have something in your head, like you want to make that true, something like that. You want emotional stability, you want stability from all sides and also you want the image that you have in your head to be fulfilled. Am I right? If I'm right, click on the like because definitely I'm getting that vibe out of these without even picking out any cards. I'm getting that vibe. I don't know why. Also somebody who is uh, very, very responsible, who is not very childish, who is having a lot of responsibilities, who is very, very mature. With a full card coming up, maybe you guys might be going somewhere else, traveling, this represents traveling, taking your step um, foot in, placing it in a place where you don't know how things would work. So maybe you're going somewhere, you don't know how things are going to be. You're kind of stepping into a new phase in your life. It can also be like you are starting something and you don't know how it's going to go. But still, you do have some kind of um, brave feeling that you can get this through. You can do this. You can get through this. And therefore, you're going with it. Also, with the Ten of Wands, you're kind of uh, shoving up the responsibilities on other people around you. You do not like to be responsible. I don't know why, but... We have the responsibility card in reverse. You do not want to be responsible anymore. You don't want to keep things um, going the way others want it. You are just going to be a little selfish is what I feel. Okay, so again, guys, so with this card, it's all about uh, stepping in and not knowing where life is taking you. At the same time, if you felt like there were several people who betrayed you, several situations that made you feel bad. Now definitely things are going to change for you completely. If you felt bad in a situation earlier, do not worry because things are going to go in a different way for you. Things are going to manifest differently for you. That is what I can see here with these cards, guys. And there is nothing to worry, right? Everything is going according to your expectations. Things are turning out according to your plans. Do not worry about anything because if you're going to worry, it contains a lot of negativity and is going to impact negatively on the situation that you're in right now. What is coming up for your love situation? Let us find out the important part of the reading and then I will be picking out some message cards they have for you, right? Wow, beautiful card to start with. This person is maybe coming in to apologize. They want to, they cannot let go of you. They no longer feel like they need to let go of you. So they might be stepping back inside for some kind of an apology, some kind of a love offer. They want to give you some love offer or the planning to give you something, guys. The planning to be more direct, upfront, loving, caring. And they are most probably coming towards you to give you some kind of an apology. They feel like you love them. They feel like they have feelings for you. You have feelings for them. And something, uh, this person feels some feelings are mutual. 
and therefore because they feel this a uh, mutual feeling for you they're going to come in for an apology and they regret whatever they did they are sad for how things are turning out for them and for that they're coming in to apologize to you guys that is what i can see here with these cards right and uh, please wait guys now i will be picking out cards for your love situation love cards so please wait Okay, so now this is going to be the messages this person has for you guys. So what is the message this person has for you? Let us find out. My heart is telling me just do it. So this person is coming into the your life because they feel a strong sense that uh, is making them come towards you. They're going to come really, really soon if you're watching this. It can take like up to a month or for a few of you up to a week. And to confirm that, you can book a personal reading with me. All of the details are down in the description. You can, to confirm when this person will come or anything. I do also spells. I do um work with magic so if you guys want to contact me all of the details are down in the description and also any kind of uh, spell work any reiki sessions i'm happy to help guys what else do we have here for you you inspire me this person feels a very very strong bond with you no other compass to you so in case if you feel like this person has not yet tried other things or they have not yet moved away from you yes they have tried that they have tried to move away from you and they have tried to let go but the only thing is that this person is not able to let go guys even though they feel like they need to let go of you they need to move away from you it's not possible for this person to do that right so that is also one of the reasons they're not coming towards you because they don't know how to make this work they don't know how to make this happen right otherwise things would be very different for them that is also one of the reasons why they are stepping in with you and uh, they have tried being with others but they can't they always love you that this is not possible for them we also have i knew then what i do now would have made a different choice this person probably left you because they didn't know what was about to happen in the life without you in case if they knew that uh, certain things would happen they wouldn't have um, been a certain way that they are right now guys right so this person loves you too much and they're not able to let go even if they try to because even if um they wanted to let go of you it is something really hard for them to let go of you right that is the reading for you guys i will be picking out three more cards to kind of like wrap up this reading so let us pick out three more cards for you guys person's messages towards you i could i wish i could take back the things that i said so this person hurted you badly they said certain things that she shouldn't have probably said and they wish they could take back all of those things i have thought a lot about you lately so this person has been dreaming about you thinking about you thinking about how your life could have turned out to be because definitely i see a lot of change in this person's life so therefore they are wondering what could have turned on in their life and what could have been different in their life so they're all up in their head 
they are uh, wanting some kind of a change and they definitely want to work things out with you come together with you and do this union that is what i can see here especially for this person guys right and thank you all so much for joining me here if this reading resonate with you guys like comment and subscribe i will see you all tomorrow my beautiful beautiful so bye guys and if you guys want to book a personal reading with me all of the details are that in the description bye guys